Welcome everyone, welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Enemy Within. We're uh, in Mumbai, I believe, and we're fighting aliens. Oh yeah, wait, did you thought we would fight someone else? No, we're fighting aliens, and they're very annoying, and they're, yeah, trying to uh, get Toku there. With that seeker, which is not very nice. And there's two more sectites over there, so we're gonna kill these. Uh, Kyle. Oh yeah, you've already shot and missed, I believe. That's not very good. Why can't you shoot? There we go. Uh, only four damage. That's not very good. Well, we need to get this one. So, Jestimo, take a shot. Oops. Nice. Only four damage! Oh! Oh, interesting. That actually, uh, if, even if you don't kill him, you, uh, or it, you can still uh, stop him from trying to strangle people. That's quite interesting. 47, yeah, just... Oh, not enough ammo. Great. Well, I'll just have to reload then. Toku! You can barely hit anything because of the catching breath thing, but hopefully you can hit this guy and get some revenge. Nice. Excellent. Alright, Svenorp. Uh, let's get one of these guys. 43% only. You only see that guy. That's not very good. Uh, how about we go and flank that guy? Although, that guy could also flank us here. So that's not good. However... Yeah, well, we gotta take that chance. Oh, he's on Overwatch. I forgot that because I haven't played in a couple of days. Nice. I was quite lucky, actually, because if that guy goes to flank us, we may need all the... What? You don't see that guy still? Oh, come on. Really? I'll just take a shot then. 43. Nice. Very nice work. Oh, floaters. Still haven't met those, of course. Oh, that guy's not doing anything at all? Well, it's fine with me. Right, sniper. You need to get some kill, Ky uh, kills, Kyle. Come on. Get him. Nice. Excellent work. All right, we gotta reload and rearm and everything. Um, so let's do that. Reload. You also... Moving. Toku. Let's get the meld as well. And then take care of the uh, floaters. Alright. Affirmative. Covering now. Oh, is there another seeker? Oh, no! No, 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 no. Take him out, please. I don't want to lose more health. Nice. Ugh, only four damage. That's not good. Damn. Ah, oh, damn it. Not again. Right, Svenorp. You need the kills. Take him out, please. No. He's right there. Toku. Let's get this uh, meld and try to kill the uh, Seeker. Nice. Nailed him. Excellent. Bloody hell, Kyle is... Oh, wait. What, what the hell is going on with the Seeker? <laughs> He's caught onto the ceiling with one of his tentacles. And I thought Kyle was... Uh... Oh, no. Of course not Kyle. It was Toku that was strangled once as well. Kyle was strangled now. All right. Let's reload. reload complete. All right, where's those floaters? Where are you? Can we hear them? Well, they're probably either here or, I believe, uh, here, maybe? I'm not sure, to be honest. Let's find out. Heading to that location. Toko. Let's see where they are. Hello? Nope. Nothing here. Uh, here. Ah, there we go. Oh, they're up there. Overwatch. 63%, that's good enough. Let's try a shot. Not bad. Only two damage, unfortunately, but not bad. Right, uh... Hopefully you're not gonna... 
get the overwatch. No. Oh well. Kyle, uh, let's move you closer. Can you shoot from over here? I kind of doubt he can, but let's try it anyway. Let's do overwatch with a pistol. No, 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 hug her down. Ugh. Oh well. Right. Where did he- oh, he went behind the wall. That was very rude. Let's find them. Nope, they're behind the wall. <laughs> well, let's have some nice overwatch ready for them then. This is half cover. Uh, Kyle. Oh no, that's that's full cover actually. Is it? What? Was that a dash? Oh, I didn't know. Oh well. Uh, Toku, let's get you over. Oh, you can't go into full cover. Alright, Overwatch. Where are you? Oh, hello there. How are you today? Oh, nice. One more floater, and that's it. Hello. Uh oh, he's gonna shoot. Ow! Vehicle fire. Damn it, Squaddy Svenorp! Damn, that was a bloody lucky shot. You bastard. You absolute bastard. On my way. But, what? Why can't we see him from there? Oh, come on. <sighs> bloody bastard. That's affirmative. Roger, I've got my eyes on Let's take this bastard out. I can't believe the last floater take my guy out. It was a it was a support as well. I think I heard something. That's ridiculous. Come on, reaction fire. All of you take a shot. Kill him. No, two misses. Ooh. Um or a sniper actually hit. Nice. Hopefully he's gonna go for Jasdemo. Yes. No, he's not gonna do anything. Kyle, you need kills. Take him out, please. Nice. Mission accomplished. Bloody hell! The last bloody floater killed my guy. I can't believe that. Or well, woman. Now that is bad luck. Ah, oh, damn it. We need supports. Definitely need support. Alright, Kyle. Damn. Okay, excellent. Uh, you know what? We're gonna give you snapshot. Just to mix things up a little bit. Svenorp was killed. Oh, he was... Yeah, he was a support. Damn it. Right. We but be we have a problem. Commander. Panic. Argentina. Africa. Yeah, that's not good. Let's see the situation. One, two, three red ones, and we only have... We'll only have one satellite ready. <sighs> Shite. I guess we're gonna lose South Africa. No, actually... Uh, do I want to lose the bonus of instant interrogations, or do I want to lose... China's money? Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Oh, I hopefully I'll get some council missions. Let's see, 12 days. Right. As the alien attacks have become more frequent, our casualty rate has climbed. Our troop shortage is becoming a problem. We should it start is. screening potential candidates at the barracks immediately. It is, this is bad, wow. Let's uh, get some more soldiers. Bloody hell. Beam weapon, seven days, come on. Satellite uplink. We can build another one. 200. I think I should do that, to be honest. Also need the foundry. But I think I should build another uplink. So we can really cover everything we can in the next month. Hmm. Or should I do the foundry? 
Foundry is very nice. Now let's do the uplink first. Money first. Let's see what we can sell. We can sell loads of stuff. Yeah, loads of stuff. Look at all this stuff. Jeez! Alright, another uplink. Alright. Come on, give me a console mission. Our satellite is prepped and standing by for launch. We are ready to deploy it on your orders. Yeah, only one. Excellent officer training school, finally. <sighs> Took a long time. Officer uh, training school online. Uh, no, I don't want that. I want officer training school. All right, squad size, yes. Squad size two. What? Oh, I don't have the money. Okay. Uh, we'll do. We'll rectify that. Anything else? Look at all that stuff we have. Crazy. Fusion cores. Loads of flight computers. That's ridiculous how much we have. Alright. Squad size 2. Finally. Yes. Rapid recovery. We need that. Wet work. I don't know. Yeah, let's get some more money, shall we? I don't need... Oops. I don't need... Ugh, I don't need these this many al alien alloys. It's way too much. <laughs> Unlimited money! 200, excellent. Alright, uh, officer training school. Rapid recovery. Yes. And wet work. Also could do new guy, actually. I think that would be a wise choice right now. So let's do that. How much was it? 150, right? Right. I'm not gonna push it. I'm gonna take what I can. Uh, yes. Alright, let's see all the new guys. Excellent. Uh, support. Nice. Special one. Oh yeah, of course. You guys have now been promoted automatically. Uh, Wanderer is a sniper. One Cooler Aussie is a support. Excellent. Sergeant Tuckner is another support. Very nice. Benjamin Anderson. Okay, let's see who we have. <coughs> we have... Mr. Harl Harlequin. Uh, why can't I type? Is that right? Yes, Harlequin. Welcome to XCOM. Harlequin, you're, uh, you're an assault. Excellent. Then we have a heavy. It is Mr. War Dragon. Welcome to XCOM. He just strikes me as Russian for some reason. Oh. I'm not looking at the flags as I said. This is just, uh, you know... Cool, that way. Um, Alright, Katarina Smirnova, another heavy. Let's see who you have. You are... Christopher? Oh, I can't put all that in? Oh, come on. Alright, so sorry about that, Christopher, but I'll do Christoph... Uh, uh, <coughs> the bloody Steam updated and they still have these slowdowns. Very annoying. Zumbach. So, sorry about that, Christopher Zumbach, but there you go. You also wanted to be Polish. There we go. Voice. There we go. <coughs> Welcome to XCOM. Next, anyone else? Yes. Let's see who you are. Another assault. And you are... You're Walker. Welcome to XCOM, Walker. Excellent. Alright. Now we have 
At least a nice little compliment. And six people in a squad, so that's good. Oh, be weapons. Yes. Yes. Laser pistol and laser rifle. Alright, let's do... Oh, carapace armor. What? So long on the heavy lasers and everything. Jeez. Let's do carapace armor first, I guess. That's ridiculous. I should really do xenobiology to get... Uh... Yeah, I should do that. Let's... Let's do xenobiology first. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, but at least now we can uh, build rifles. We'll do that soon. Council report. Operational. Mustn't forget that. One. Alright, let's launch the uh, satellites. No console missions. Oh, shit. So we're going to lose the uh, instant interrogations bonus, I guess. Also losing South Africa. But I want China with the really nice money. Damn. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Damn. Additional uplink required. And we need to place an interceptor there. Oh, come on. All right, there we go. Let's get an interceptor. All right. Oh, that's they're not going to be happy. That's for sure. Hello, Commander. Yep. Much to our regret, a number of council members have recently withdrawn their support. I know. Excellent work, God, Commander. still a B. This council is <clears throat> pleased to see our continued support of this project has been worthwhile. We hope that your current successes only mark the beginning of an enduring effort to eliminate the extraterrestrial threat. Damn, I would have liked that instant interrogation thing. Oh well. Remember, we will be watching. But now we have lots of money. And we need more power. So let's excavate that, and then we'll do a steam generator there. And more stuff. And we can start building these satellites. Let's see, uh, this will be two, four, five, six satellites. Okay. Six satellites. Wow, we don't have the money for that. Jeez. Well, let's sell some stuff then. <laughs> wow. Uh, I guess some flight computers? I don't know. Now let's do it like this <clears throat> and build satellites. Six of them. Bloody hell. Alright. We'll still need stuff for uh, rifles and such. Xenobiology and the alien containment and You're such. You're telling me that we should risk the lives of our troops so we can take one of these things alive. Yes. Yes. Without a live specimen, I'm afraid we've reached the pinnacle of what my team is able to accomplish. And how do you suggest we do this, Doctor? The autopsy I've just completed confirms that the alien's physiology is quite similar to our own. A highly concentrated electrical current delivered at close range should cause mirror... Close range? And what happens if it doesn't work? Do you really think this is worth the risk? I do. We do not know our enemy. How can we hope to stop something that we do not understand? If we can capture one of these creatures alive, we may be able to communicate with it. And interrogate it. Find out what they want. Where they're operating from. Yes. That possibility outweighs all risks, in my opinion. I can construct a safe enough facility to house our captive, but I do not know how we could possibly communicate with it. Not to worry. I will see to that. All right. I'll speak to the commander. You don't have to. I've heard it all. I was peeking through the hole. Right, new research. <clears throat> Alright. Holy crap! That <laughs> 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 
all the, these autopsies yeah look at how much time we would uh, how much time we're gonna lose yeah that's not good uh, I don't know carapace armor or arc thrower or some of these because some of these will oh mutant autopsy I think he gives us better um, armor if I'm not mistaken yeah let's do that this is the most physically aggressive specimen we've discovered so far which the troops fondly refer to as the muton I can only assume there's a colorful backstory for such a designation yeah there is whoops well thank you very much for watching anyway um we're in trouble but we're doing good now so i will see you next time bye bye